There's been a vaccine against varicella or chickenpox available for no more than three decades, and it's surprising, therefore, that it's not being more widely used in Europe. We saw the vaccine introduced in the United States of America in the mid-90s, so it's now been used there for nearly 20 years. But amongst large European countries, the only example where the vaccine has been widely used so far is in Germany. There's therefore a debate as to whether or not this vaccine should be used more widely in other countries. The main reasons for arguing that the vaccine should be given to all children is that it's clear from experience in the United States that the vaccine does prevent varicella and makes it go away in the population as a whole. The number of severe cases of varicella and the number of deaths from varicella have gone down very substantially in the United States since they introduced the vaccine, and in particular since they introduced a two-dose course in the middle of the 2000s. The main reasons that are given against using varicella vaccine, apart from the cost, are that a low coverage use can actually drive up the, cause, uh, the, the number of cases of severe varicella, simply because you still see varicella circulating in the population, but increasingly in older people. And if you get varicella when you're older, then you're more likely to get seriously ill. The other argument that has uh, had a big effect on the decision to use varicella vaccine is the theory that by in preventing transmission of varicella in children, this will stop adults from being exposed to varicella and their immunity to it will fall and the number of cases of zoster or shingles might go up. And this concern, this theoretical concern, has stopped many countries from going forward with their programs. In actuality, uh, the experience in the United States, while it shows that the zoster cases are going up, is very clear that they're not going up more as a result of the varicella vaccine being used. And so this uh, concern is probably unfounded. For that reason, as the evidence comes in, uh, it's likely that we're going to see varicella vaccine increasingly widely used, but it will be critical that it's used at high coverage rates, because as I explained earlier, low coverage rates can be disastrous.